Ryan Thomas, I'll be back here bringing you some commentaries on day two of week eight. It's a one mile six furlong group three race here at Goodwood. We've got Land of Marvels, Leon Van Rensburg, Birthplace, Graham Clutterbuck, Bon Mamam, Ryan Tamasebi, Cool Minx, Rosie for Darren Thompson, Delphine, Jim Murray, The Perfect Mix, your favourite, Joshua Sutherland, Happy Hawk for Dan Hughes, Denver Baraka, Vinnie Gerrard, Foxy Michael Scala, and Melbury Namibia for Davy Ladd. And the stalls are open and off they go. And Birthplace was very slow out the stalls there for Graham Clutterbuck and the jockey riding that one along up the rail just to try and get it to get back in there. But it's ridden it into a terrible position and gets stuck in there behind Melbury and Namibia. But at least it's not tailed off at the back of the pack. But Graham Clutterbuck's not going to be too happy with that start from Birthplace towards the head of the field. It's the familiar Jim Murray black and red silks taking up the running. He's got a lot of front runners in the league, likes to dictate the pace, and Delphine doing just that here. Swinging right handed with a good four or five length advantage over Melbury Namibia. Foxy just on the outside of that one. Bon Maman more towards the rail. Birthplace has now got that room that it wants to make progress so that it can race a little bit handier after such a slow start. Land of Marvels just hitting a bit of a flat spot in just behind that one for Leon Van Rensburg in the dark blue silks with the yellow hat. The favourite, the perfect mix, is just travelling widest of all at the moment. The black and red silks for Joshua Sutherland. We've got Happy Hawk, Cool Minx, Rosie and Vinnie Gerrard has Denver Baraka as the back marker at the moment but again for that particular stable. Jim Murray likes his front runners and Vinnie Gerrard likes his to come from off the pace so never rule his out just because they're at the very rear of the field. So Delphine uh, diminishing advantage now uh, it was five lengths not long ago but birthplace uh, came out the stall so slowly has now moved up into second place and is only sitting about a length to two off the leader at the moment as we come into the final seven and a half uh, seven furlongs sorry and they're just coming slightly downhill before they'll start swinging right-handed for home so delphine's advantage is now about a length and the jockey's just kicking on there and wants to start applying the pressure and you can see the lead is opening up birthplace still traveling in strongly behind melbury namibia moving forward on the rail foxy on the outside of that one happy hawks one that's making smooth progress from the rear of the field the perfect mix still being ridden very patiently the favorite bomber mam's a bit stuck on the rail land of marvels is now the one that's dropped out towards the rear of the field as we come and pass the four furlong marker now it's delphine that still has the lead land of marvels has actually pulled up at the rear of the field for Leon Van Rensburg. So Delphine has the lead over Birthplace. Melbury Namibia has the rail. Happy Hawk now flying down the outside in the all blue silks for Dan Hughes. Denver Baraka is one that's making smooth progress as well from the rear of the field alongside the favourite, the perfect mix. With just, just over two furlongs left to go and Delphine finally surrenders the lead to the Happy Hawk that flies down the centre of the track for Dan Hughes. A few of them looking, a, uh, looking like they're struggling in just behind those but the perfect mix is now starting to get going so it's going to have to fly to catch Happy Hawk in the final furlong but Denver Baraka is perhaps looking more likely on the outside here. So Happy Hawk, Delphine, Denver Baraka flying home and trying to make progress but the line's coming up. Delphine is battling back up the rail but Denver Baraka picks them off and wins it for Vinnie Gerrard. I told you to watch out for that one just because it was at the rear of the field. It doesn't mean anything with that particular stable. It's flown home and it's just picked them off. Delphine really game up the rail, surrendered the lead to Happy Hawk, but battled back really well uh, to actually fend off Happy Hawk in the end. But Denver Baraka blindsided that one and just got it before the post to win for Vinnie Gerrard. Wins the Blackrock Philly Stakes by a short head from Delphine. Happy Hawk in third. Foxy ran on for fourth for Michael Scala. And Bomber Mam stayed on a bit too late for Hurricane Run Ryan Tamasevi uh, for completes your top five there.